day. Do you have a bathtub or sink that is draining slowly? If you do, pay attention. A plumber told me this once, and uh, these guys are getting eighty dollars, hundred dollars a uh, an hour to do this, and um, hopefully it'll save you some cash. You won't have to call them. So, <clears throat> for your bathtub, first thing you need to do is take these two screws out here. Uh, and then this uh, this style um, of plug will just uh, or stopper will just pull right out. You might have a screw that you need to take out. Whatever you need to remove that as well. Then uh, you want to go ahead and get a washcloth uh, damp. You want to stuff the washcloth in here so that you um, basically block that off. So it uh, you know allows very little if any air in there. Then you're going to run the water, uh, at that point it's very similar to your toilet. Run the water so you get enough in here to kind of cover the hole and then just start plunging. Uh, it's going to pull some gross stuff out of there so maybe you want some gloves or something to grab it and throw it in the toilet. Um, other stuff it will push right down. Um, you know just do that uh, six or seven times and um, should be taken care of. I won't demonstrate here because I uh, just did that a couple of weeks ago, but I should be able to show you on the sink here. Okay, this is my kid's sink, so um might be kind of gross. We'll see. I don't know. Did it, uh, actually, I took the drain off and cleaned it out a couple of months ago because it was so bad. I couldn't get much this way, but uh, for the sink, you only need usually a little bit. Um, you got your hole right on the uh, outer side here, or inside, whatever you want to call it. Plug that up. Uh, we're going to pull our stopper here, run some water. Alright, there's a little bit in here, so what I'm going to do is put this plunger in and then pull it or push this down so it opens and just start going feel the suction look at all that stuff gross sometimes you can let it go and it'll wash right down if you give it a rinse with enough water um, other times what I'll do is I'll just pull this so it gently closes Eventually that water will slowly go down the drain and you'll be left with all that nasty crap up there. You can just grab it out with a piece of toilet paper or something and should be good to go. Thanks a lot for watching. Give me a like, give me a subscribe and uh, stay tuned. Take it easy.